Bye. Goodbye, Cruz. See a never loser. <laughs> okay. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, Peppa! I haven't even started this spooky game and you scared the shit out of me. Bruh. Fucking bitch. Holy. Okay. Oh my god. Dude, she fucking climbed the fuck out of my arm. Okay. And then we do this. And then, let's see. I don't know how the game audio is going to be. And then let's remove the wing. What are we feeling? What are we feeling today? I think we're wearing our skeleton onesie. Are we being lazy? Are we being lazy bones today? Being lazy, cozy bones today? Okay, bet. Okay. Goddamn. Dr. Good! Thank you so much for the follow! And in verse. Verbice? Thank you for the follow. Thank you. Whoa. Okay. Audio visual. Music volume. One. Okay. Well, I can't hear anything. I can't hear anything. Um, new story. Two bit, one, one, two bit, one bit, two, two bit, one bit, two, let's do two bit. Is there supposed to be music? I can't, I can't, I can't tell yet. Um. It is recommended that you start with spine chilling story of school scissors after you are trying. Okay. Uh, I cannot tell. I don't hear anything. Am I crazy? Seven mm. months of great times with Yeah. Oh. Here's to another amazing seven months. <laughs> Hi, thank you so much for the resub. I think they're supposed to have some. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Maybe we'll restart. Maybe maybe that's it. Here we go. Let's do that. Um, play. Hmm. 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 Kingdom Hearts fan, thank you so much for the follow. If not having sound confused me, I thought my head's so broke. Yeah, that's why I, I was like, I'm not, maybe? I feel like we're supposed to have sound. Right? It seems like we would. Scuff, bro! How is it scuff when it's supposed to work? I didn't know how to play the game! If this isn't my scuff, this is the game scuff. Don't fucking, don't fucking scuff me. This is the game being scuff. It's not me, bro. Okay, hold up. But it's got, okay, maybe, maybe I'm just like tripping. Okay. World of horror. Okay, 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 okay. okay. What if, uh, first three minutes? Welcome to the well. Bro, okay, so there is music. Bro! It's, it, it's not my fault that it's not working, bro. Why? Okay. Okay, no bet. No, 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 no. It's not my fucking fault that it's not working. It's not. Don't worry. Don't worry. We got this. We got this. Okay, you know what I'm going to do? 
You know what I'm going to do? You know, I'm going to be the cool streamer. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to recheck the fucking files. Silence. Silence is a good horror game, that's for sure. Nah, 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 nah. Trust me, trust me, trust me. It's fine. Okay, you know what we're going to do? We're going to uninstall, and then we're going to reinstall. That way, there's no fuck-ups. It's a fucking terabyte? Bro. God fucking damn it. No, it's not a terabyte. Oh, that's my drive. I'm stupid. Never mind. <laughs> Got an angel. <laughs> Hi. Okay. Start again. Stream gas, stream gas, stream gas, stream gas, stream gas, stream gas, stream gas. Wait, is this, is this what I need to, wait, bruh. Huh? Motherfucker, just fucking work! No, I wanna play the game! What's Windows saying about sound from the stores? Um, so, it says it's fine. So, like, headphones? Uh... Headphones, this. Bro. You have boy, Mr. Infinite! Freem bark, Thank freem you. bark, freem bark, freem bark, freem bark. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, guys! Okay, maybe we put it in default? Bro. Bro, ain't no fucking way, man. I just want to play the goddamn game. Hey, what's up, me? Ow! That's loud. Okay, it's loud now. Ow. Ow, that ear raped me. Ow. Ow, you guys couldn't hear that because I didn't set it up. <laughs> Ow. Fuck. That was so loud. You heard a beep that. Yeah, that was through my fucking mic. Ow. <gasps> oh, fucking Christ. Okay. Let me lower this. Ow. Why are you not? Ow. Okay, so it's not... It's supposed to be going through my Elgato thing, but it's not. Oh my god, bro. Hi, Haru. Me over here about to use my basis for what mic and input order. Okay, so so here here's the thing, is that I use okay, so I use the Elgato Wave XLR, right? And I, I quite literally don't have this issue with other fucking shit. But for some reason it's like I have it set. The proper fucking output is the Elgato. Oh, wait. Hold up. Elgato system. Okay, okay. Hold up. 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 Ow! No. It's ow. Okay, I'm taking. I'm so sorry. It's not working. <laughs> I muted it. I muted it for you guys. I'm so sorry. It's not working. <laughs> it's way too tight. We could hear it very low. Yeah, I put it. I put it all the way at the bottom. This thing's blasting in my ears. Okay, hold up. 
Where is this being picked up from? Oh, it's being picked up as a system sound. Oh. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I know. Big VTuber. Big VTuber cringe. Big VTuber grunge. Um. Okay, no, I figured I figured it out. Porkums, I'm gonna put this in in Twitch mod so you can see. You can see what I mean. It is linked properly. <laughs> but It is forcing on system. It's weird. So game output's odd. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's not me. It's the game. A cap it, A cap it. It's not me. It's the game. I'm not... <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. I'm so sorry. Can't change the audio in-game? Mm, no. It doesn't- it doesn't matter because, um, it's supposed to be output in the Windows setting. Little- little speaker thing? Speaker. Speaker thing. Extra. Speaker. Look. Speaker. 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 It's okay. Okay. New story. I feel like 2-bit gives other stuff. Candice Lupus, thank you so much for the follow! And large coconuts as well. I think it's just game weirdness. Yeah. Find chilling story. Okay. Something strange is happening in our town. Yeah. Roped figures can be seen gathering in the woods at night. People are going missing. Disgusting creatures are terrorizing the seaside. The rapid technological progress of the modern era brings comfort, but also new unknown threats. Old god malicious eldritch being ruled by Earth eons ago, our awakening as reality starts to crumble. Armed with clues. Oh my god, it's the deja vu car! It's the initial D car! Armed with clues, spells, and your dwindling sanity, you'll investigate mysteries across the city and real realms beyond. An old train slows down and stops at its last station. The end of the world is at hand, and you finally arrived in the doom town. Out in the world of horror. You found a new item, straight razor. You found a new item, Hayaki. Bet. You've been following the weird cult for weeks now, barely surviving the encounter with the skin hag at the nursery. It's a race against time, and you can't race into our town to save. Uh, okay. School of Scissors. Another boy from your school has disappeared. Rumor has it a terrible woman has returned from the grave. A woman with the widest smile and the sharpest scissors. Oh my god. This is kind of eerie. <laughs> Your missing friend has left you a notebook. If the rumors are true to stop the tall woman with scissors, you'll need to perform a ritual to force her material form to appear in our dimension. Accomplishing this requires first the drawing of an eldritch sigil and the lighting of holy candles. You can only hope your friend has left them somewhere around the school. You hear a faint sound while walking outside the biology classroom. Inside is an old anatomy model. It's hard beating. The sight almost makes you thick. Minus one stamina. I feel like something horrible is happening within the school. You must hurry and find those items. Okay. Explore the school. As you enter the school gym, you notice a strange black doll propped it up against the wall. Oh, Jesus. Against your better judgment, you approach the doll. What you see makes you gasp in horror. This isn't a doll. Your sudden movement causes the tiny black fighters to flee, revealing a white, half-eaten corpse. Bruh. 
Oh no. Well, first time I've been able to catch stream when you're playing World of Horror. Hell yeah. Hey, Amber. How are ya? You found an additional page from your friend's diary. It seems that the blessed chalk was left in the pool. You must hurry to find it. Um. I'm scared. <laughs> you found an additional page from your... Okay. To you open the door, click on the handle, and drag the... Oh. Oh, hi. You shouldn't risk that again. Hello. Okay. Dicks! Jesus Christ, don't fucking scream dicks in my ears, you fuckers! Oh, I mean, don't catch me shoes since I found you. I think it was on Kyo's the button. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! Bro, I don't like this shit. You guys are gonna scream dicks in my ears the entire fucking stream, aren't you? Started playing it yourself? Oh shit. You entered the damp smelling sport wing. You notice a backpack drifting on a swimming board in the middle of the pool. Could it be what you were looking for? Oh, I don't want to enter the water. Suddenly the water turns murky and you realize you're not alone in the pool. A bloated figure emerges from the murky water, blocking your only way out of the pool. What the fuck? During each turn, you'll build a sequence of attacks and moves from action ring B. Once you've filled the sequence bar, see the launch sequence button to finish your turn. Okay. Dicks! Jesus! Stop it! <laughs> Stop! Bro! You guys are just a bunch of dicks, actually! Fuck you! Okay. I'm bringing you guys up here. Fuck you. Okay. I wanna kick. Kick. I'll just kick you a bunch of times. Kick. 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 You kick the bloated teacher. The bloated teacher hits you. By the time you'll discover new combat is available for your action, first need a weapon. Oh, I have a stray razor. Inspect, equip. I don't have time to change equipment. Fuck. Prepare your attack. Use an equip weapon. I don't have an equip weapon. Shit. I'll just kick you a whole bunch again. Kick. Okay. I have... Oh my god. <laughs> Stop! Where's my health? Am I blind? Is it 14? That is spelled. I got spelled? Very good. It reminds me of a certain American high school. Okay. It says I can't fucking equip, so. Defensive action. Support action. Oh, I can get allies? Okay, sorry. I'm, I'm taking in the UI. Launch beacon. But I can't. Look for an improvised weapon. Oh! Look for an improvised weapon. And then kick. Oh. Branch. Equip. Okay, I have equipped the branch. Now I will attack with my weapon. Yay! Oh, wait, you guys can't fucking see my UI. Hold up. Wait, let me move me. Let me move me. I want you guys to be able to see. Maybe. Oh, oh wait. I think I have. I think I have a good idea. Hold up. 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 Hold. 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 I have a good idea. I have a good idea. You want to hear? You want to see this? You want to see this really good idea? Oh my god. Look at this. Look at this shit. Oh my god. Really good idea, clock. Really good idea, clock. And then you know what I can do? I can like grab it, right? I can grab it, and I can bring it all the way down. Right, 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 and then I can. There you go. 
There you go. Improvised idea, a cow, a clock. We got this. Let's all come back. Okay. You found blessed chalk, which you can use to draw the sigil. So I found the blessed chalk in the pool. Explain to me how that fucking works. I should probably make myself bigger here. Hold up. I'm sorry. You know, fucking, you know, scuff, scuff a clock. There you go. Here you go. You get to have more of me. Are you, are you excited? You get to have more of me. It's the best. It's the best timeline. More Freemer. More Freemer. There you go. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it well. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it well. There you go. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Come to sigil the best you can, I'm like, hopefully it'll be enough. Okay, but I need the other stuff, right? Okay, can I equip this yet? Okay, I can equip it. Well, where's the notes? Friend's diary. Careful with the lines. Mario's act is strange. The sigil can weaken the demon for a while. Careful. Okay. So we needed it to look like that. Okay, bet. Okay. It's got... Is it like that? Or is it... I feel like it's like that, right? Yeah, it's like that. Okay. And that's it, right? That's all I needed? <laughs> so just, we get the, if hidden the candles in one of the classrooms tomorrow, I will try to perform. Okay, so I have the chalk. I need the candles. Oh, she's creepy looking. Mm. Hi, Cruz. Can I can I make a request that you don't scare me during this, please? <laughs> Tell me when suddenly face twitch slips. I'll be your new biology teacher. Could you help me move some stuff in my office? You shudder feeling the teacher's gaze on your back. Plus, I I helped her. I don't... I didn't find the candle. Pizza! Where'd you get pizza? Did you go to Costco? You went to Nikki's? Oh, thank you. Can you get me a lactate? Thanks. Explore school. I need, I need the candles. Bro. Okay, I guess I won't. Oh, I found the whole candle. Oh, thank you for lactate. Costco pizza? Wait, you guys don't like Costco pizza? Uh-oh. Costco pizza is good. No cap. Hey, Kurj, I might have fucky wucky. Um. Oh, never mind. I unfucky wuckied. I unfucky wuckied. Okay, thank you. This game is scary. Okay. So I was looking in the mirror? Fuck you! Oh, okay. Find the holy candles in your friend's backpack. You lit them and struck them. Everything's ready. Yeah, okay. Oh no. Oh, that's fun. I love that. You take a step back as a raining am amorphous mash slowly takes shape. Soon it'll become a tall, woman-like creature with three faces all connected by a wide smile. Oh, yay. I have your chance to find and defeat this horror. It's also your only chance. Twisted and twitching, the demon woman enters the classroom cackling. Am I, men <laughs> am I beautiful? You're so beautiful, woman. 
Oh my god. Attack with your weapon. Please don't kill me. How much? Okay, so I should be good. I missed the attack! Oh no. Okay. Are you finding these games all the time? Because I like indie games. Can I eat? Okay, it doesn't give me shit. Mm, okay, so she has 8 HP. And she hits me for like... Like 2 HP. So I wanna, I wanna make sure I get her properly, right? Attack boost. Your next attack has an additional 10% chance to hit. Okay. Prep attack. Hit. Prep attack. Fuck. Punch. Clear. Okay. I think I want to do... Prep attack. Do this. Kick. No, not kick. No, not this. Click. Attack. Attack. Yay! <laughs> How was your day? Good. Good, good, good. Are you an indie game? Because I don't think you <laughs> The ancient horror lies dead on the classroom floor. Shelving goes all the way into nothingness. You find your friend, gravely wounded but alive. You help him up. And you both in limp away to the school as the police sirens get louder. Spine chilling stories is your ending game. Okay. For now. Okay. Okay, bet. Oh, wait, so there's multiple stories. Okay. I survived your tutorial, yay! Hmm. What's your that? Okay, so this is the the standard intro that we already did. Okay. A supposed cause of destruction of the Library of Alexandria, a perfect black marble statue has been recently discovered and currently waiting in a museum of 000 for its long awaited premiere. Old God rules both you and the enemy deals extra damage. World of Horror. Okay. Inspired by Investigators in the 80s. Uh, I love the I'll come back. Oh, I already kind of did this. Enter Lighthouse. Multiple padlocks prevent you from entering the building. You need five keys. Oh, so I can probably find the keys and use the story I do. Really is a good step to take it. It's basically. Could you set, run for you, set up for you? Oh, okay. <laughs> You're currently investigating any weird mystery, recent new favorite clippings, and notes collected in the next room should point you in the right direction. Hey, Kyo. <laughs> hey, Kyun. Or Kyun, sorry. Mm, okay. I've eaten the za, but I don't like the crust, so... She'll sit at my desk. Inexplicable and morbid events have been plaguing your town for some time now. You've marked down five of them, hoping that there is something connecting them. You can tackle these five mysteries in, or in any order you want. Beware, your decision will haunt you for the influence yet unsolved mystery. Okay. Saved friend. Oh, spine-chilling story of scissors. Bloody brief of beckoning bullet. Chilling chronicle of a crimson cape. Let's do that one. A new game is... 
is spreading amongst your friends a, a dare to stay in the unused school restrooms after classes. A dare to meet Akamanto. That was originally harmless fun has turned deadly. The body of a boy was found last week. The school principal has banned the game, but that's only made it more popular. Akamanto must be stopped before another kid is killed. To advance this mystery, investigate the circled location. As you progress the location, the rules may change. Gather gospic, go gospic, gospic. Good money. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Can't investigate your home. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. One of your friends says it doesn't believe in curses and he intends to complete the dangers there. Oh no. Okay. So travel to school. You're already there. Investigate school. Investigating the gym. As you glance around, you notice that more and more people are wearing strange masks, unlike anything you've ever seen before. As you turn to your friends for reassurance, you notice that some are also wearing these eerie masks. Their voices sound muffled and distorted, and you can't shake off the feeling that they're not quite themselves. The hairs on the back of your neck stand, and you realize something is terribly wrong. A sense of dread creeps over you as the masked people are swarming through the store. Filling their carts with food and survival equipment, you notice good prices have already skyrocketed. You realize that there's a need to act fast and you want to if you want to have any chance of survival. Okay. Hmm. You report it to your principal, who promised you will take care of it. Hmm. Seeing the two chopped off heads, you can't help but wonder who's been preparing your food for the past week. Oh god. Research occult cuts. Oh no! Reading the ramblings of a madman has made you sick. Fuck. As you enter the school gym, you notice a strange black doll propped up against the wall. Oh, I don't have the anatomy class perk. I don't even. I, I don't have it. Fuck. Mention a young doctor who performed life-saving surgery on a victim of a brutal assault. The assault happened in the toilet stall. Maybe he still works at the hospital and can share some information. All right, let's go to the hospital, guys. Someone has been branding the patients with occult symbols. Branded like cattle. Are they preparing a feast for their eldritch matters? Plus 4% of the doom. What does 4% of the doom do? We learned that the doctor suddenly left the hospital after the latest murder, taking all of the records with him. Why would he do that? That's not the only bad news. Your friend didn't come to school today, and another body had supposedly been found. Oh, fuck. It's basically game over. Oh, no! The museum started hanging up posters promoting the Greek art exhibition. Unaware of the danger, the opening night may prove to be, prove to be the last night for all of us. Eat, eat, hot two is coming, and now you know the date. Okay. Principal is ordered the school to be closed down for investigation. Hmm. I want to go pick up a weapon, though. I don't have any stored items. Manage threat level experience to funds. Something is wrong. You don't see anyone on the street, and you could have sworn it was crowded just a minute ago. You better hurry out of here one reason. Oh, fuck. You break the window and get inside the school unnoticed. The cursed to toilet is located on the third floor. Get over there. Oh, god. Okay. You hear a faint sound while walking outside the biology classroom. I need the anatomy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no! Doom meters at the top, 14%. Oh god, no. You wait in the stall, trying to be as quiet as possible, suddenly squish, squeak. You hear the sound of rubber boots as the unknown liquid drips on the tiles. Squish, squeak. You can now see the top of his head. He's taller than any man you've ever seen. The door slowly opens. Oh no. A masked man dressed in a red coat, clearly too tall for the ceiling, emerges from outside. Tell me, his voice sounds like a faulty radio. Would you like red paper or blue paper? Um, since he's wearing a red cape, I'm gonna assume he likes red, so red paper. What? Uh, you hear 
scary click coming from the door's direction. You're locked in here with the crazy man. Fuck! No, he has 26 HP, are you kidding me? Oh no, wait, I gotta improv. Hold up. Where's... Support. Can I improv? Oh my god. And then let's kick him. Oh my god. He stabs me! Found new item, broken bottle. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. So I have a weapon. I have a broken bottle. I can equip it, right? Throw it enemy. <sighs> Throw an item, damage is- Jesus Christ! Don't fucking shoot! Stop! <laughs> oh my god. Can you fucking scare the shit out of me? Ah! Fuck you. Fuck you, man. Holy shit. They shot him for me? Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh no, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to kill this guy. I mean, I deal three damage, right? Let's see. Three, minus three, minus three, minus three. Okay. No, there's a good chance. There's a good chance. See? Get fucked, idiot. Blood flowing from the wounds on the tall man's red coat makes it look like the man is slowly melting. You hear cackling coming from behind the mask and faint, and when you wake up, he's gone. Somehow you know he will be back in another stall, another school, another city, continuing the hurry. Chilly, chilling chronicle of the Crimson Cape ending B. He left something behind. Ooh. Ooh. Plus 30 experience, minus 5 doom, plus 1 reason, damn it. Okay. Oh my god, sorry, cruise is very low. I did it! Okay. Found you, item. Whoa, preparing for the worst, people are stocking up on everything, making it harder for you to find what you want. Oh. Okay. My home. Inside your mailbox, you find a small key. What's it doing here? Take the key. Whoa, what clothing can I get? Ooh, I like the jacket. Bet. Oh, did I not do it? Take a bath. A shower will help you calm down, do wonders for your sore muscle. What temperature should you say it to? Um. Let's do extra stamina gained. Okay. Take a... What is that? What is that? Oh no, I don't like this. I don't like this guy. Silver, thank you for the follow. Hey, fast as a cliff. How are ya? Oh my god, bro. Is that something in the window? Okay. Let me equip something, though. Save. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to exit. Your home. Business. Oh, that's cool. Uh, what's happening on the TV? Local police are helpless as more victims turn up downtown with their throat slash. Okay. Access your storage. Okay. Wait, didn't I get the mask though? Items. Crestfallen mask. Whoa! Oh, I look scary. I don't know if I like that. Allies and perks. I have no perks. I have no spells. Okay. Maybe I want to go to the store and see what I can get. Back to town. I can go back to the. I can enter the lighthouse and open one of the padlocks. Yeah! Okay, we did it. Okay, leave. Leave. 
leave your home. Uh, and then I think I want to go check what's over here. Choose a mystery to investigate. Sorrowful Saga of the Moonlight Sailor. It began with one fisherman who dragged something truly awful from the belly of the ocean. A dark, writhing ooze that mesmerized him beyond control. He hid himself away for a week, adoring it not to be seen until one moonlit night when a young girl spotted his boat drifting away. A single lantern swinging at the helm and the captivated fisherman singing eerily to his catch. Now more and more fishermen have begun to find the vile ooze in their nets, and one by one they are disappearing. Soon the ocean will have them all. Okay. You start your investigation hoping to overhear some rumors of the fish market. Sounds about right. Investigating downtown. Music is a vibe, right? Kind of cozy. You hear a chipper voice sh shout during jog around the area. You turn your head to see another one of your teammates in casual clothing, smiling blissfully unaware of everything going on. What's up, Captain? Notice anything weird happening? She tilts her head and presses a finger to her chin, thinking hard. And with a tiny O, oh, she begins telling you a strange story from the other day. Although you braved the stench for hours, you claim nothing besides the fact that the fisherman had a wife. Perhaps you should pay her a visit. Hmm. Here, let's see. I kind of want a weapon. Oh my god, it is Shiva! Oh my god. Okay. Uh, bum, 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 bum. do I have? Oh, do I not have any funds? Oh, I do. Apparently I have funds. A random discounted item? Okay. You don't have enough money. Book. Equip. Okay. Okay. Body shot me. What is this bottom right stat? Oh! You're right. I'm fucking blind. The investigation is taking a toll on you. You start to miss the most obvious leads. No! When you arrive at the fisherman's house, it stands long vacated. Peering it through a dusky window, you recoil in shock. Travel the mansion. That pair has been following you since the morning. You finally managed to lose them, but you can't shake the feeling that it will only get worse. Oh, no. The fisherman's wife lies in the kitchen, mutilated and covered with black marks. Oh, no. A heat wave continues with record temperatures. Continuing your investigation takes more and more effort. <gasps> Fuck! Maybe I should go home and take a bath. Travel the seaside. Can't investigate in your home, shit. I have a steak knife, though. A sudden blast of heat grabs your attention. An older man sitting next to you screams in pains as he's engulfed in fire from seemingly nowhere. As other people start to panic and help the burn victim, you spot a hooded woman starting in the, staring in the distant. When she sees you, this, she starts to run. You can't check out the feeling that you were the target of the su supernatural attack. Oh, God. Nearby dumps. Oh god, the hooded woman disappears in the corner, and when you get there, she's gone, already mixed with in a crowd. In a nearby dumpster, you find the sulfur stinking hoodie and an envelope containing your photo, plus a curious incantation. <gasps> a spell? Who the fuck is that? The young man has glassy eyes and mumbles his, re his replies as he, careless as, as, care as he caresses as his catch. The beating movements of his arms disturb you. Discard two item cards to complete this quest. Hmm. What's this? Oh, it's a spell. Cast a spell, forget the spell. I want to keep the spell. Wait. Oh, it has so much doom. Bella, thank you so much for the follow. Okay. I don't have anything stored in here. Suddenly, the air around you begins to whirl. A supernatural wave of freezing wind is approaching. Oh no. The blizzard chills you to bone and disappears as quickly as we get. Bro, I'm gonna have no stamina by the time I hit this guy. 
Oh no. And I can't go home. Can I go to the hospital? Walking through the hospital corridor, you hear disgusting slurping sounds coming from my closet. Fuck! Oh no. Guys, I don't think this is gonna work out! Oh no. She has 15 HP! Oh my god. Just. Oh my god. I'll just. I'll kill ya. I'll kill ya. Okay. I got a nuts experience to level up. Okay. I need more stamina. Um. Is this strength and stamina? I want stamina. Wait, do I have to pick this? Wait, I can't pick it. No! Oh, art knowledge. Fuck, I'm an idiot! Hot bath. I want hot bath. You've got an eye for art. Regain one stamina for all successful events. Skill Oh, <gasps> yes! Okay. Who's that person who says like they're raging in the background? Oh, that's Cruz. That's my assistant. So, uh, I can try and figure out how to not have him pick up every two fucking seconds. Um, unfortunately, we share an office though, so you're gonna hear him in the background. Uh, I decided to enter a small shady bar in the docks. Maybe some of the old fishermen can help you in your quest. However, persuading them to do so might be difficult. Hmm. Try talking to them. Asking too many questions makes everyone's nervous and you get thrown out. Bruh. The full moon shines bright in the cloudless night sky. The ink black ocean waves glimmer eerily. All the residents have drawn their shutters tight and locked their doors. Your footsteps are silent in the sand. The only audible sounds are your ragged breathing and pounding heartbeat. I was wondering why he sounds like he's playing League. Oh, he is a League gamer though. I think he's playing some other game. Probably Destiny. Or Rainbow Six. You arrive at the water's edge breath breathless. The possessed fisherman boats filled the horizon with their light, tiny yellow spots navigating across the dark ocean of the dark sky. You cannot make out the figure of the boards. Hypnotized, you watch as they bob their way out of the harbor. Their lanterns move farther and farther away, and you hear the odd chanting slowly fade with the wind. You stand in the cold until the final boat is out of sight and it's pitch black again. There's nothing to do now. You head home. The weird chant is still in your head. No one spoke of the fishermen after they sailed off. Grieving mothers would not let their children anywhere near the cursed beach. Over time, people forgot the last time they saw a boat out of the waves. Sorrowful and the Rewards for solving this mystery. Ah. Okay. Did the water level suddenly increase or is the city slowly sinking? Oh shit. Another small key. Okay. This thing, this, something's trying to get out of there. Lighthouse. There you go. You, you're home. Say goodbye. Hi, Orange. All right, have a good night. Come down and wonder. Ooh. Okay. Okay, so we have this spell. TV host is getting a big octopus, at least that's what she claims. There's too many tentacles. Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay. There's nothing in here. I feel like there's slowly something kind of like building out over here.
bloody brief of a beckoning bulletin. As the decades roll on, technology has only developed further. These days, computer bulletin board software allows computers to communicate over the lines. All it takes is a computer and a modem, and anybody can connect to the bulletin system or even host one of their own. Once you connect, you can read all of the messages on that bulletin and even post your, your own to start a conversation. Many use them to share files or to chat about their favorite topics, everything from video games to sports to idol culture. But in the wake of the sudden string of weird suicides, things aren't all fun and games. Rumors have surfaced that the deaths are linked to the bulletin system operated from somewhere within Shiokawa. What is behind the suicides? How could so many people all been driven to take their own lives? Bet. Let's do that. Hey, Sniper! How are ya? Oh, yeah. Even if the rumored bulletin system phone number is found, there is no hope to investigate without a computer that can connect to it. Maybe the school library has one that will work? That's fair enough to, to assume. Dark forces scheme against you. You don't know who you can trust anymore. A curse? Quest to the forest location twice to complete this quest. Forest? It said that a famous priest died on this rock. Perhaps his mis mysticism has seeped into it into his power. Knowledge check success. Touching it with your hand, you feel a newfound knowledge forming in your. Oh, I got a spell. Enthrallment. Gain an additional follower. Discard on you. Cost four reason. Oh. Wait. Does that mean I get an ally? That might be useful. Hey Yamata, how are ya? Gibsy, thank you for the follow. Okay. Uh, let's investigate one more time for the quest. You hear a chipper voice shout during a jug. Oh! Here. After a bit of playful coaxing, you convince her to join you for another lap or two. The extra comp competition motivates you to push yourself. Harder, you wrap your workout tired, but satisfied with yourself. Minus one stamina, two reasons. Okay. Hey, Orange, thank you for giving a tier one stuff. Thank you. After searching deep in the woods for some time, you notice the body of a young student clutching a note. Oh. Course note. I write this for anyone wanting to stay behind. The sacrifice is worth it. Life's meaning comes from our relationships. Share death and the connection will outlast. There won't be anything left but us. Everyone here is waiting for you. So if you lose your resolve, just listen to the voice of humanity. Sure, buddy. Uh, thank you. <laughs> Investigating downtown. When you enter a metro car, you notice an oddly shaped package on the seat opposite to you. It's marked with your name. You reach for the package, but hesitate. <laughs> An icy feeling is setting in the foot. Mm, let's try. As soon as you pick up the package, you realize what you're holding and drop it in horror. Plus eight experience. Bet. You lug the cardboard box full of PC parts up to your apartment. Stairs, teeth clenched as you heave it up. The goddamn computers are heavy. Yup. A woman jumps off from her apartment covered in gore. Between sobs, she tries to explain what happened. She was taking a shower when suddenly the shower head started spraying blood. A trail of blood leads into a dark apartment. Mm. She might kill me, so let's try to calm her down. A woman shifts and smiles weakly. You feel like you've prevented something awful. Okay. Phew! Okay. You wipe the sweat from your brow and you finally finish setting up the computer in your bedroom. After a few tests, you're now certain that everything is functional. The newscaster on the TV says that the suicide rate is still climbing. Where is the, the morbid trend of trend beginning to catch on in other nearby towns? You need to act quickly. Okay. Can I expect a pipe bomb? Yeah, but you never know. I, I expected it to be kind of like a, what do you call it? Um, Like a body part, so. Loud knocking wakes you up in the middle of the night. Open up, shouts the deep voice from behind the door. I know you're there. Ugh. Before you can answer, the door's letterbox suddenly opens with an unknown invader tries to look inside. You lurch back in shock. The man sees you, tries to get in, screaming curses the whole time. A neighbor calls the police and the attacker escapes from your apartment building. Bro. I'm going to find a lead. You head to the hospital with how many deaths there have been there. The hospital is in chaos, the sap looks exhausted. When the receptionist lets her head down onto the desk for a minute, you slip out of the waiting room and into the heart hospital corridors. Okay. When the patient came home one morning covered in scars and babbling about aliens, the police hadn't been committed. 
They're mumbling something quietly as you pass by. Mm, I don't have the paranoia one. Probably. Fuck! You overhear two nurses talking about a girl whose suicide attempt failed. Apparently, she's recovering at her grandparents' home at the village of the city outskirts. You exit the hospital and make your way to the nearest bus stop. Bet. Your path is blocked by a rotting corpse covered in poison ivy. Yummy. I still have my steak knife. Oh, shit. It's okay. <laughs> Bitch. As you pull into the village bus stop, the news story comes in a bus driver's radio. An entire class of Shiokawa students left in front of a train, hand in hand. You merge urgently as you exit the bus and begin searching down the village streets. Bro. Ooh, I don't like that. <laughs> you sit in the middle of the field, frozen in terror. A rip in our reality shows the horrible future of our planet. Seeing the familiar figure looking back at you, you can't help but wonder if it's our world or if it's just an illusion. Hmm. You and the figure get closer to the portal, ready to swap places. Where are you? Lost in time and space, you drift in nothingness until something pulls you towards the light. The temperature abruptly drops and you shudder in the icy cold. You find yourself in the middle of a snowy wasteland. A sudden gush flings up to your knees. You inhale deeply, feeling your chest tighten and ache. Your fingers and ears are already numb and freezing. You have to move. The frozen guard corpse standing on an eternal guard duty finds you where they the Usurper King kindly decides to share with you forbidden knowledge with you. Oh. When you find the girl's house, her grandparents greet you, so only they thank you for your efforts to stop deaths. Forgive her, her grandfather says as he leads you to their bedroom. She's a kind girl. Something has happened to her. Mm. Oh no, I got frostbite. Fuck. Miss Liz, thanks for continuing your sub. Thank you. Dark forces scheme against you. Wait, I got another curse? Paranoia? Chance of losing reason each time you lose stamina? Bruh. The Kremlin girl is more than happy to not only confirm the bulletin's existence, but to give you its number. You have to do what it tells you. Trust me, you won't regret a thing. She beams at you as her grandmother struggles to make her swallow the pain medication. I'll be back to join you all soon. Wait for me, okay? This quietly, you give the grandparents your phone number and hastily leave. Okay. A friend returning from a trip to Africa has invited you to dinner. This time, they've outdone themselves. This is a real feast full of exotic meats. It's getting late and you can't stay for too long. But the host asked if you want to take anything home with you. I knew you'd like it. Your, pack your friend says, winking packaging. Oh, give me steak. What steak do? Plus, oh, as a new status? Eat. Hunger. Huh? Oh no. As soon as you arrive home, you dial the number and put the handset headset handset onto the modem. Your heart pounds as the computer fans exhale. The system hums, you hear a brief dial tone, and then it finally connects. <laughs> That's the stream is Thursday morning. Hey! It's two in the fucking morning, goddamn. Well, thanks for coming to say hi. Welcome home. Did you like this so far? Sure. I'm glad. Take your phone off the modem and put it in your ear. Put it to your ear. Okay. You listen to the staticky signal of the other end. It's harsh to your ear, but then the noise begins to slowly change to something beautiful if you want to join it. Do I want to attack the copier? Oh my god. Oh god. Oh my god. Come on. 
There you go. We should kill it. There you go. You defeated together. You wrenched the phone from your ear, nearly tossing it across the room. You could have killed yourself for that thing, swearing... Sweat. Sweat poured down your face. You immediately yanked the computer's plug from the socket. Dangerous bands of rioters are gathering around the downtown area. The police are hopeless. What is this game? Horror... World of Horror is scary. Yeah, I mean, it's a really cool, like, it looks inspired by Genji Ito and has, like, some, some horror, like, stories that you have to solve. You're kind of like a mystery student trying to figure it out. Kind of cool. Okay. Take a bath. I'll take the stamina. Ooh, do I want to peep through the people? Are they coming closer? Oh no, they seem to be fine. Okay. Bum, 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 bum. Hmm. Disciple. We gain one stamina for Eddie. Okay. Me. Level up. Okay. Art knowledge. Leadership. What does this do? Plus one charisma, natural ability to guide others. You've got an eye for plus one knowledge of various rituals and religion Mitch. Uh, I think since there's a lot of people, I want to do charisma. I want to do stamina again because I seem to be doing okay. Okay. Seems like I have to go back here. Another book from your school has disappeared. Rumor has it the terrible has returned from the grave. Woman with the widest smile. These friends love you a notebook. Okay, so I guess we'll redo this one. Explore your school. Getting access to the student database would certainly speed up your investigation, but the receptionist would never allow it. If only there were a way to make her go away for a while. Oh, I don't have that. No! Okay. Explore the school. The pair has been falling. Bruh! Peek outside. Yeah! Let's not. Okay, let's go to the library. You enter the dam smelly. Yep, enter the water. We got a big, big, big yucky teacher. Let's see. Easy clap. Found the blessed chalk. Okay. So. Friend's diary. Okay. It's a square. Yeah, I think it's that one. Yeah, it's that one. Okay. I still need... I still need the candles, though. Hearing footsteps behind you, you realize that you aren't the only student here. A girl wearing a demon's mask starts giggling as she gets closer. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, come on, man. You only have 14 HP, though. I might be able to get you. <laughs> I think the steak knife was actually the play, though. Wait, what's that? Pick it up. Box cutter? Plus three damage. Yeah, but my steak knife is pretty. 65. Yeah, I like my steak knife better. Plus chuck found. Holy candles. Still haven't found. Why did I just stab the shit out of them? Exactly! Impossible angles and smoothly moving lines make your head spin. Bro. 
Oh yeah, you found the holy candles. Bet. Wait, what's that? Oh no. Take it back because the writing more just slowly takes shape. Soon it becomes a tall woman like creature, three faces all connected by a white smile. That was your chance to fight and defeat this horror. Twisting and twitching, the demon woman enters the classroom, cackling menacingly. Am I beautiful? You're so beautiful, my girl. I think. Okay. So I should be able to do this and that and this and that and then that should kill her. The ancient horror lies dead on the classroom floor, slowly dissolving to nothingness. You find your friend gravely wounded, wounded but alive. Yeah! Sister, I have no clue what's going on. We're, 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 we're solving horrors. Sister woman has gone for good, or is she? You shudder, knowing the urban legend that will inspire another kid in another city. Plus 30 experience, 15, minus 5 doom, reason. Okay. Get a new level. Bet. What's this one do? Tuned with natural rhythm of life. There's always a way out from seamless loop. You got an eye for detail. Hmm. I like quick thinking. I think that's good. Okay. A weird epidemic keeps the staff in the hospital. Literally skipping the line will cost you more. Bruh. Well, I seem to be doing okay, though. So let's take a bath. I'm gonna take that. And then... <laughs> I don't like the shift in the audio. <laughs> Wait, can you hear the shift in audio? This shit is eerie. Oh god, don't put the don't put the fucking regular smile. That shit is spooky. Don't do that shit. Don't do that shit here. Don't do that shit. No. No, don't do that shit. You staring at me? You staring at me, chat? Fuck you. You finally made it inside the cursed lighthouse. Your gut is telling you two things. That whoever or whatever is behind the weird events must be the highest floor of this place and you should run away from this place as far as, as fast as you can. You're afraid there won't be back once you start climbing these stairs, bro. That's so spooky. rest of it. No, I'll be good. Start climbing. Nick, thank you for the follow! You're stopped by a girl wearing a dirty black school uniform. I'm sorry, but I can't let you go any further, she says, reaching for her bag. It's too late anyway. You instinctively take a step back when you notice a knife in your hand. You have to think fast. Not enough charisma? Bruh. Good morning. <laughs> hey! Following the winding staircase, you are stopped. Wait a minute. Someone has been taking photos focused on you. The photos include the enemies you fought. But there's something wrong, but you can't precisely say what. So like the second enemy you fought this run. That was... Akam... Wait. This run, right? I think I started with Akamanto? I think the first enemy I fought in this run was the Akamanto. But Suta Chan was the was like the event that I ended up fighting afterwards. But then there was a bloodsucker. Oh no. No. 
No. Climbing up the winding staircase, you are stopped by a masked man wearing an expensive suit. He says, taking the jacket and the mask off. Nothing personal, really. Bruh. 26?! Okay, so... Maybe I could do ba 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 ba. No. Ba 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 ba. Yay! Let's have a trial of blood. Following the winding staircase, you find a metal gate that blocks your way. The cable that should be powering it. At is currently disconnected. The power box itself is covered in a weird moist goo. Just inhaling the fumes make your eyes itch and water. But the power of the gate, you'll need to disconnect the faulty plug. Oh, you're surprised at how much effort it takes. Minus three stamina? Fuck you, man. You feel sudden pain in your arm around the branded mark? Oh my god. Following the winding staircase, you're f Oh no. Someone broke into your apartment, stole all your clues and newspaper clippings, and pinned them here. It's like the title of the second mystery you investigated. I think it was this one. Yeah! Dark clouds swirl around the lighthouse. Did you arrive too late? The next day, everything feels like a bad dream. You managed to stop the ritual awakening an Eldric old god. But what's done is done. It will still its slumber again and again until the stars are once more. Congratulations, you are safe for now. Oh! You gotta do all of them when it's like very random for what you get. Here, let's try a quick play again. Oh, I'm a different girl now! Regeneration. Regain four stand. Oh! Yeah, you can either set the character god and switch yourself or randomize with quick play. Oh, okay, so the goal is that you want to get all the keys. Oh my god, I can be a goth girl. Bet. Account of abnormal arms. I remember when it started, the woman next door was strangled to death in her bed. With no sign of forced entry, the killer was never found and the apartment remained vacant. You can get free money. Oh, wait, what? Whoa. It won't let me go back, so I guess I have to investigate it. Apartment is closed and she lived alone. What other ways and are there? Maybe you can get the apartment plan to compare it with the other flats. Investigate the hospital location twice to complete this quest. You 
immediately understand that the only difference between you and the crazy person is that you have been caught. You convince them to sneak out and join your quest. I got a friend? That's cool! You enter the hospital looking for information about a certain patient. The main corridor is dark and strangely empty. You spot a nurse at the registration booth. She's asleep from exhaustion. You ban the idea of stealing a patient's document. It will hamper your investigation for sure, but a well-rested nurse may save the hospital. Never mind a music specimen with an elongated arm for jelly bread post. Something is wrong. You don't see anyone on the street, and you could have sworn it was crowded there a minute ago. You better hurry out of here. Mm. <laughs> Allows two additional inventory slots? I don't need that. There's no good, there's no good items. No! I don't have any stored items for my last runs. Shit. Oh no. Oh no. Vending machine. Wandering through the empty corridor, you find an old vending machine. You don't recognize the brand or sodas inside, but you really could use a drink. Cheapest. Ah! You can buy an off brand soda. No! On all deal minus one damage on all attacks in combat. Are you kidding me? I have like four dollars, bro! Looking around the rank side from your recently deceased friend, you discover a half finished painting of a woman, her skin and goes to pale yellow in color. See this is serving you struggle look at it. Bro, I'm getting fucked. The level of sound of the multiple voices are too loud for you to, to ignore. When you enter the apartment, everything turns silent. Oh Jesus, you don't seem to be doing okay. Um, okay, so I need a improv. Maybe I'll prepare and then attack? No. I found a branch. Better than nothing! Nothing. <laughs> Boobies! One neighbor is complaining about her missing underwear. <laughs> <laughs> As you prepare a bath, you think all about it possibly so far. You're so tired. Hot bath. Hot bath is inviting that you spent an extra out in it. How is that fucking neighbor. Knock on your friend's door and wait. Hey, I'm really busy today. Let's hang out. Okay. okay. Loud knocking opens in the middle of the night. Shouts to your voice behind your door. He draws in a familiar sort of butt. Bro! You kidding me? Huh? Every room is connected by vents coming from the unused boiler room. Could it be? You enter this dark boiler room and trip over the pipes, cursing you find the light switch and gasp in horror. It's not a pipe at all. It's a long rubbery arm coiling around the room and ending the ventilation. Oh my god. Oh no, it's gonna fucking jump out and grab me, isn't it? I don't wanna look! I don't wanna look! 
Okay, yay, let's go. You must fall on the ground when you see a wide open stare at the dead pervert, his elongated lips stretching and disappearing in the vent darkness. Inside his mouth, you find a tiny key. <laughs> when the police arrive, the whole building gets searched. Following the arms, the detective finds the body of a man stuck in the ventilation shaft. Later, he is identified as the building caretaker. In his closet, police find pieces of underwear and voyeuristic photos of tenants. You're questioned thoroughly and eventually releases the murder case is being covered up as a case of an unfortunate gas leak. Bruh. Alarming account of abnormal arms ending A. Rewards for solving the mystery. Okay. Old Town start receiving the outside signal. It must be radio mass failure. I swear that's a guy. I just press things. Tiny key can be used to open certain locks. Okay. Powder! <laughs> hey, Powder! Hello! Thank you so much for the raid! Hi, everyone! She didn't save? Oh, God. Oh, no. Hi, everyone! Oh my god. Yeah, please, if guys, if you want to go check out Powder, she's my, my VTuber sister. Hello. I hope you had a great stream. Thank you so much. Hi, everyone. My name is Frame. I'm the demon overlord of junk food. Today, we are playing World of Horror, which, if you're not familiar with it, is a mystery game uh, where you're solving some occult mysteries in a really cool, like, um, like retro, pixel-esque, like, horror art style. And I'm sorry if you can hear my assistant in the background. He's playing video games as well. But thank you so much, everyone, for the follows. Insane Spirit, Corbin Silver, Caccio, Femboy Soldier, Cho Random, Smiling Gentleman, and Karsten. Thank you for the follows. Hello. <laughs> what did you guys do? <laughs> You're too cool for raid messages? That's fine, man. We, we, we vibing. Ron report of a rancid ramen. Out of thin air, a brand new ramen restaurant opens in town, adored by everyone. Once people take a bite, they can't stop. And day and night, the queues stretch out of the door. The shambling customers stuff themselves with dish after dish, Green while the blind wave. owner sits silently behind the counter, grinning and polishing his gleaming knife. Hey, Vicky! Thank you so much for the resub! Thank you! <laughs> Half-Life 2? Oh, that sounds like fun! I hope you had a good stream! Thank you so much for dropping your community here. Thank you! I'm Himehu, thank you for the follow. You've determined to discover what makes this ramen so enticing. What is the true power? Dog meat? Human meat? The flesh of the gods themselves? Bet. Watching the local news, you spot a familiar street. It's a feature about the newest ramen shop. The food critic and the manic look as he describes the ramen. His description makes your stomach turn. Bet. Discard two item cards to complete this quest. Bitch, I don't got two items to fucking dis- like, to get rid of. Fuck you. You find an envelope lying in a pillow in your bedroom. Inside it's cash and note from someone who has been watching you. They wish you luck in your task and promise to meet you soon. How did this envelope it? Weird. People just randomly showing up. Flow of life, thank you for the follow! The problem I promised I'd give them to someone super cool and awesome and cute stuff. Oh, thank you, Powder! Oh my god, you're so fucking sweet. Thank you, I hope you have an amazing rest of your night. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. If I go downtown, I can shop, right? Oh! My steak knife! Yes, I love you, steak knife. You are my favorite. Wait, was the branch actually better than the steak knife? Ain't no way. Wait, the branch is better than the fucking steak knife? No way. Are you kidding me? Lower number for speed is better? Oh, really? Okay. Okay, we can discard. There you go, discard this. We'll find, we'll find another thing. Well, the mighty stick. 
Experts are baffled by sudden appearance of 20 stone statues lined up in a row in the middle of three, three dot park. You can cast one spell without paying anything. Bet. I don't have any spells though. <laughs> Passing by a faulty elevator, this door suddenly open. You take a step back, noticing a weird tall woman standing in the darkness. Do you live here? I've never seen you. Ugh, I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Oh boy. Cyclops neighbor. Fuck off. Oh my god. Um, what if we grab? Can I triple? This enemy seems to be weak against this type of weapon. Mm. Why are you kicking me? Get wrecked, idiot. Fuck you. I'm the best. <laughs> Give him a monocle? No, I can't. Bro. The only true way to investigate is to get into the restaurant yourself. Okay. That's that bet. Bet. We love that. We love that for me. That's the dog. Thank you for the follow. Mr. Ooh, your neighbor is a horror manga artist. He's certainly come up with a satisfying ending for his new story. Uh... Huh. How do you come up with the stuff sent? Minus 15 experience! I need that! I did get money though. Plus two experience for each investigated look. Oh. Wait, that's kind of good. Just a dodge the incoming flash con. Flash combat action adds a chance to... I'll take that. And then we'll equip. <laughs> Best get downtown. But money? Money. Money. Weird man. Through the dirty restaurant window, you notice a shady looking man wearing a jacket covered in strange symbols. He stops in front of the house, visibly nervous before he enters the house. He turns around as if he's checking for the unwanted followers. What could this mean? Hmm. I follow. The door is locked, but you repeat the knocking pattern in the suspicious man use. A moment later, the door opens and surprise teen with greasy hair also asks, Who the hell are you? Mistaking these nerds for cultists sure is embarrassing, but deep inside you're relieved. Okay. Dear Equinox, thank you for the follow! Ugh. Dude, I have no reason. I have zero reason. Hold up. That's a new status. I need it. I need more reason. reason, bro. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> Love how the shop is based on a picture that became a meme like 12 years ago, right? This freaking Shiba is like everywhere, man. Oh my god. What does the police station do? Manage threat level. Eh, I'll be fine. When you enter a metro car, you notice... Examine it! Yippee. Okay. Uh, dude, I'm so close. Can I equip this? No. How many times do I have to investigate downtown? Someone taps on your back. Shori, is is the bush still running? I'm so late for a meeting. The bush bosh isn't going to kill me. Startled, you quickly turn around and what you see. Uh, I really don't like that. It's the face ussy. It's the face ussy.
He stabbed me. Bet. Level up! Okay. Uh. Before Arcane Grass. Additional spell slot. Mm, I'm gonna take that and then stam. Reason, actually. I need a reason. With the pulling of some delicate strings, you get a ramen into the lab. While handing over the gathered material, you hesitate. What should you send to the laboratory? Just a vial of ramen soup. And merely a day later, your friend rings your door. Her face is pale and is shaky, and her hand holds the analysis seat. You usher her in the bowl of the door. You feel ill looking at the charts. While they could couldn't identify some of the particles, they did discover a highly addictive drug in the broth. The ramen restaurant must be immediately closed. Oh, Jesus. A week later, police and government officials are looking over the ramen restaurant used to be. Nothing remains but a gap in the street and aimless community of customers. Rawr. Oh, no. extra reason, so that'll be fine. That's just based on Doge. There's a short clip of Shiba Inu opening the shop window, since the most of is basically the trace off. Oh, shit, okay. Chronicle of a okay. We've done Chronicle of a Crimson Cape, so that one should be Tragedy Tale with the Mod Turgy teacher? 2B used to be one of the most outstanding classes in the school, at least before their teacher's disappearance. Her replacement glides through the school, entrancing all those around her with soft voices, calming emotionless eyes. Now she stands at the front of the class, scribbling occult symbols in chalk and hissing lessons about old god. The children no longer play, but sit in their seats until dark, chanting along, learning of the eldritch masters and preparing to serve them. Brrr. I don't know if I like that. I'll be real. Following a rumor, you visit the house of the schoolgirl who acted really strange in class. The girl's parents sit crying in the living room and fearfully point you upstairs. Pleasantly surprised to meet your old friend. While waiting for the train, she undoubtedly changed a lot since we've last seen her. These days, she's moderating a web forum dedicated to paranormal. Maybe she knows something useful? Torrid! Thank you so much for the follow! Came back to my new skis, Jira. Hello! Yeah, Powder raided me. Hello! I'm her VTuber sister. Rocket through the park to find a little girl crying alone in the playground. When you ask what's wrong, she says that she can't find her mommy. Luckily, you spot the girl's address in the backpack lying nearby. Let's take her home. So that she can take it from here. Okay. Climbing a tree, you get better view of the class. We're just commanding so some portals drawn on the blackboard could help in the future. Oh! When you stop by home to pick up your lunch, you find a pile of letters in your mailbox. You've attracted the attention of something truly evil. Yippee! We love that. <laughs> Despite your best effort, you feel like your neighborhood is starting to change. Location threat level increase. Oh, I love that for me. That is great. You stand in the middle of the field, frozen in terror. Rip in reality shows- ooh. We always enter. Lost in time and space, you drift in nothingness until something pulls you towards the light. The temperature abruptly drops and you shudder in the icy cold. Fuck. No! It wasn't worth it. Fuck. A little boy from the school has been attacked by his classmates. Alright, so let's go to the hospital and go see. Oh, Jesus. You're stopped by a masked man wearing a lab coat. He introduced himself as a researcher from Tokyo Univ University, testing a new treatment method that promised revolutionized modern medicine. Holding out a pile of documents, he tells you that he can heal your wounds for free. You just need to sign here. Sure. Later, you wake up in a surgical ward. There's no sign of the doctor, but you feel healthier and notice that one of your wounds is gone without a trace. You can select one injury status and heal it for free. Oh. Wow. 
I think the minus two strength is pretty shitty. But this also sucks. Thank you. That's worth it. That's worth it. Okay. All right, have a good night. Find yourself in an old, unused part of the hospital. You take a deep breath, the disgusting smell of fraud remains still lingers in the room. It used to be the hospital's mortuary, where doctors determine the cause of death. Check out the cabinet. Sometimes flashes in the corner of a dusty drain your stone kit. Oh, that is useful. Plus three charisma. Uh, plus three stamina. One for I'm gonna use that now. Huh. What? I just who actually was great to catch this game. Alright, everyone. Ember, have a good night. Dark versus scheme against you. You don't know who you can trust anymore. Oh no. Ocean is calling. Change to negative effect with each C side effect. Oh shit. What the fuck is this? Where are the books you can find were donated? I don't like this icon. Oh no. As you turn to the corner in the corridor, you're met with some gruesome side of a student's ghost. The girl is just standing there, pointing a bloody finger at the one of the lockers. She's gotta be trying to show us a clue, right? Okay. Bruh! As you open the locker, the spirit shoves you in. It's full of knives. By the time you pull out of the blank, she's gone. As you recover, you sit down on why the ghost would be so cruel. All you want to do is help. You hope that the ghost can find some stuff. Fuck! Bruh. Sneaking through a window and skulk across the shattered corridors. All the classrooms are emptied out. Peering into one, you spot a corpse of the teacher nailed to the chalkboard, shaking to approach it. You spot an odd bulge protruding from his stomach. It rides against your finger as you probe it. Oh, great. Suddenly, the teacher's chest rips apart, showering the classroom with gore. From within, a child coated in meat and intestines leaps out, screeching with joy. Yippee! We love that here for us. Bruh. Chase, thank you so much for the reason. Three resub. months with Freemer Hurt. I know! Ooh, order my. I can order my guys to attack? Wow. Easy clap. As you wear, as you near the gym hall, the whoa, what was that? Chandler, ah! I don't like that. <laughs> and grab, threatening to in <laughs> intoxicate you, the creak door opened and stifled a scream. The entire school is gathered around a huge portal surrounded by black candles. From within, the bellowing of the beast being summoned echoes. The teacher stands at the front, covered in a purple robe. Her true form. The fuck. She's got 42 HP! That this attack won't cause any damage? Huh? Wait. Um... Bro, what do I do? Body oh, strike and venom. Thank you for the follows. I can't. I can't attack her. Maybe we can defeat them. The horrible. Oh, dude, that doesn't take. That takes too long, though. Oh my god.
Her dying scream, the teacher throws herself into the portal. Her vicious master shows no mercy. You hear it devour her before the connection shuts. The confused children lie on the ground crying, thanks to you, however, they are safe. Try to tell. Bro. Dude, I'm. There's so much doom. Did the water level slowly increase, or is our city slowly sinking? Oh no. one before. Did you see it? Wait, I didn't see it. Wait, what was there? Oh no. Oh no. Wait, what did I fucking miss? Oh, Jesus. You enter the art workshop. The room is cluttered with half-finished sculptures of bizarre masks hanging on the wall. One sculpture strikes you eerily realistic. Part of the sculpture looks like lifelike. You move closer and raise your hand nervously to it. It falls off. Headless person stumbles out of the scope. Oh, bruh. Urgh! She's got so much HP! Reported to your principal who promised you to take care of it. With your friends safe for now, you should look into the legend, maybe the records of the city's library. Any good items? No. I'm badly bleeding. Great. The only metro line in your town connects to the university and science complex. You could take a right to gain some time, but you've got a feeling something's wrong. No! Junebug! Thank you for the follow! Read a story about a vengeful samurai known for wearing prints of red tape. But... Don't flick me off, fucker! Why is it suddenly dark outside? You stand by the window and take a look. Black smog emerges from the courtyard, coating everything in the toilet. Ooh. Bro, everything I do is wrong! Look vibrant and cute. Oh, thank you! One of the articles mentioned the young doctor before. Oh, right, 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 right. You stumble upon a nurse trying to open the door to the intensive care unit, constantly mumbling something, then she turns around and her face makes you scream more. Oh, yippee! Oh, yippee! I love this for me. I love this for me. <laughs> Dude, I have no reason. I have, I have no fucking reason on this fucking bitch anymore. Oh my god. Open it. Using the key you found, you open the trophy case and take an odd golden goblet without a plaque. Oh. Oh. Ghost connection. After second sight. Additional damage against ghosts and eldritch enemies. Completing a mystery grants a random spell. Until Wally. <laughs> thank you so much for the freaking resub. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, I think I want to do stamina. 
Honestly, cold to the touch. Okay, I don't know what that does. Krisala, thank you so much for the follow. It's been almost a year since the childhood friend moved away to another city. He left suddenly without even saying goodbye. In a recent letter, he apologized for the disappearance and asked her to remove the furniture from his flat because he wanted to sell it. In the envelope, he found a key to his apartment. Found another letter behind the wardrobe explains your reason why you left and the shadow people were stalking him. Okay. I mean, understandably so. I would also leave if shadow people were uh, scaring the fuck out of me. That's fair, that's fair. She said she would do everything to be with you, even if it meant the cheap death itself. Oh, yippee! Bro, can we not beat me up? Ooh, a cold diary. Existing. I'll take that. He went in the stall trying to be as quiet as possible, suddenly squish squeak. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Let's do blue paper. Minus three stamina! Motherfucker! Oh no. You will die at the beginning of your next encounter. No, 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 no. Oh no. Huh? I thought he had to hit my stamina, not my reason! Bruh. Time to die. <laughs> Bruh, no way. No way. The reporting scared the boot. I even did. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, I found a camera. Chance to dodge the. To be honest, I was trigger happy and I was just clicking <laughs> to go back. Whoa! Okay, that's useful. Still confused by this UI? Yeah. Tragic Tale of Thermomagy Shaker, Contagious Coma, Moonlight Sailors, Household Hell, and Abnormal Art. Ooh, the Coma one is good. I don't like that face, though. We haven't done the Coma. Curious case of a Contagious Coma. More and more people fall unconscious and cannot be awakened. People who try to wake the patients up only end up falling into a coma themselves. The whole wing of the town's hospital has been dedicated to warding the comatose. Is there anything connected to these people, and how did the strange illness start? Let's figure it out. Eclipse Raven, thank you for the follow! I checked the news report about this weird disease to try to find the cause before more people fall asleep. Bet. Okay, so I have four dollars, so let's go see what there are here. Oh, my steak knife. Oh, how I love you, Mr. Steak Knife. You stumble upon the computer room. This is a good opportunity to check the school's database to look for anything that might help for your investigation. We find a curious folder containing photos with rising horror. You discover that you're in every one of them. The last photo shows a smiling man standing over your bed. Yippee! Reports mentions patient zero. Who could they be? Hmm. Who could they be? It's getting dark as you arrive at the cemetery, and shadows move in fantastic and countable ways between the tombstones. Finding the right grave may prove to be challenged, especially when you feel someone's gaze on your back. I'll continue. You quickly find the tombstone marked with red string. Under the stone, you find a note someone left for you. Oh! Vader Nader! Thank you for the follow! Oh, okay, you need to sneak into the hospital and borrow the information. The patient zero. Okay. <laughs> Oh, 
Even though the Metro Card is completely empty. Bruh. I hope you have a great night. Glad to discover you. Aw, thank you. You're stopped by the masked man wearing a lab coat. I don't have any wounds right now, so I'll be fine. You play the client a generous offer and continue your way. Hello, my end phone. I entered the phone. Walking through the hospital corridor, you hear a disgusting slurping sound coming from the closet. Urgh. Steak knife, don't fail me now! Oh. A sudden girl coming from behind the corner makes you stop. Bruh. Yo, can we not? Oh no. Bro, stop. Then Jabble and Magic, you found a journal describing a certain village instructions for summoning ritual. It seems that he tried to copy the entity from the Dream Realm. It's almost been a year since the trial of... Oh, no. He already did this. Meet your friend who you recently started her nurse practice. You lazily chat on the roof of the hospital watching the sunshine. Now it would be a perfect opportunity to ask about the reason why... Shares about missing patients with serious surgery. Bro. Let's hope you find the answer here. You've managed to sneak through the floor while avoiding police and finally reached the quarantine wing where all the coma patients were brought in. Their pulse are slowly weakening and their blood pressure dropping in this hurry. Complete silence of the place hits you while you hit. Oh no. Shaking, you sneak out of the hospital. One thing is certain with no sick people left alive, it's the end of the weird illness. Oh, jeez. Dangerous fans of riders are getting. Oh no. Okay. Mm. I wonder if eventually we're gonna see something there. Oh, you do custom mysteries? That's cool. I didn't get anything in my storage. Get up! <laughs> get up! Thank you so much for the five gifted subs! Thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! What the heck? Welcome, Green Beamer! Thank you! I appreciate that so much! Please be sure to thank him. Thank you. Investigate downtown twice. Maybe I'll have to go back. I don't remember if I do. Got an envelope lying in a pillow in your bedroom. Inside of cash. Oh. Okay, we'll take that. Returning from a trip to Africa is quite a dinner. Yes, I want the steak. The steak's gonna give me stamina. Yeah! We take those. We take those. Someone has been branding the patient. Oh god, I don't have it! 
Porkin! Thank you for gifting three months to Street Elements. Thank you! Oh, I can level up, I can level up, I can level up. Fast hand. Left switching of equipment during combat encounters. <laughs> You must, like, must execute. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Didn't we change the frame good though? Did we? I don't know. I don't remember. We did gonna fix that now. <laughs> Travel to school. Okay. Possible angles and similar moves. Fine. Oh fuck, bro! There's so many things that I can't do because I don't have the fucking shit. You're... Oh no! Sneaking through the window and skulk across the shadowy corridors. Oh yeah, we're gonna fight the girl. Only takes. There you go. Easy clap. Fuck. If she beats me up because I don't have that much like skill points. If her dying screen, the teacher throws herself into the portal, dragging the children with her. Bruh. Given the line will cost two more. Oh my god. Okay, I think I'm doing pretty good so far for... In terms of not having like anything like super bad happen. Because I have three more to do. I think that's good. Spark plant! Thank you so much for the follow! But the bot still couldn't use them without it. That's why everyone subs the bot. Oh! Mm. That's smart. Oh, great. We had to go see the creep again. Oh my god, no. I like how there's so many different, like, like stories that you can take part of. And because it's all, like, random stuff, like, you never know what you're gonna get. Visibility. Until the end of the current mystery, there is no doom penalty for escaping from combat. Oh. Well, I don't want to get rid of four reason, but that's kind of, uh, that's pretty okay if, like, I'm, like, I'm struggling really hard at the end. Hey, 69 experience, let's go, baby! When you stop coming to pick up your lunch, you find a pile of letters, read the letters. Mine's two funds! Bro. Where are these damn limbs? No waiting the w Not wanting to wait for the elevator, you decide to take the rarely used stairs. You suddenly trip but grab the railing at the last second when you set up- Get up to inspect what caused you to trip, you freeze in terror and are slowly standing up. Uh, that dude's got a broken neck. So that can't hurt a ghost enemy? Wait, what do I do? Huh? Anything I don't have anything I can do. Spiritual action? Oh. Clap. A 
part of a ritual. Most combat rituals are a combination of five bows and claps. Even if you don't get it right, you'll provide with a hint. Leave an offering. Burn a material offering and attempt to appease the ghost dealing nine damage. Five bows and claps. Gray. Regain one stamina cost two reason. Sever their ties to our world. Talk about our real Lord and Savior. The day of reckoning is coming, bro. What's up? No! My reason. My reason is dying. I have no more reason. I. I'm having. I'm having less and less reason. Shit. Wandering through an empty corridor, you find an old vending machine. Two more keys. So we need more reason. Okay. I need reason. Fast hand. Deduction. Oh, I'll take that. Horrible history of household hell. There are many old mansions around this town. Who Manor is one of them. Supposedly haunted by a family of four who disappeared without a trace one summer, but it is only a, but it is the only tragic event that took place. There. But is it? Oh, I can't fucking I can't fucking read, bro. I'm so fucking tired. Friends who talked with uh, with her are not sure where the mansion itself is located. You have to find the mansion first. A trip to the library may shed some light on it. Okay, bet. But I'm just thank you so much for the resub. I appreciate it. Footsteps behind you, you realize you aren't the only student here. Girl wearing a demon's mask. Bro. I'll fuck you up, girl! Take that, take that, take that. Box cutter! Somebody watching on my phone coming back, I noticed my PC is full of five seconds. Yeah, what? Really? Suddenly an empty bottle smashes on the wall behind you. You cover yourself in the glass room and notice a mass assailant. Bruh. What's all these bitches attacking me? Stop it. Go to the hospital. I have a prescription. 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 Bruh. 
Wait, there's a hardware shop. Whoa! But the chance to hit's not too good. You know, who has a prescription? I have a pres I have a prescription. Apparently, yeah. Apparently, you can get a Yakuza card. I don't know what it does though. I'm assuming it's from a an event. Fish is beating me up. Oh no, I might die. Oh no. Oh no. Give me that. Let me use it. Hunger. Prescription. I need the prescription. I need the prescription. You're on the brink of losing your mind. You decide to visit your parents, old friend, father, you see. I got plus five, uh, plus three reason. At least. Oh no. Oh no. I don't know. No! Where could you fill a prescription like this? It's for an expensive pharmacy drug. Bro. There's like no other thing I can do. Where's your HP on the screen? It's right here. I have three reason. Fuck! Oh no, guys, I think we might die. <gasps> Take a bath. Oh! Oh! Fuck! Oh no. Maybe? Oh no. Maybe, 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 maybe? No, I missed all of my attacks! <laughs> no! Maybe? Not that it matters. Look, I got black hair. Not that it fucking matters! The encounter was the final straw. Your mind has snapped and you've been locked up in an asylum. It would be comforting to step you were you were insane, but no old god is awake to devour humanity, but the drugs haven't made these horrors as the fear. Bruh. Fuck! Okay, well at least... At least, you know the first run we did? I got it. The first one we did, you know, like, I, I fucking got it. I won the first run. My attention span is very bad for this game, though. Let's play another game. <laughs> I grow bored. I grow bored of game. <laughs>